Good morning, good morning, good morning. My name is Tiffany Roth and welcome to Monday Morning Motivation. Okay, so the Tyson fight, you guys know I love boxing. And so this week, uh, Tyson, Tyson and Jake Paul, they fought and everybody was watching on Netflix and it was like, what's gonna happen? Somebody from the old school versus the new school. And it was extremely disappointing on so many different levels because I think we all had this comeback story in our head, at least if you're from Tyson's generation, you wanted to see him come back and just like crush it. But what you saw was somebody who was just panting and doing the best he can. He recovered from an illness and it was like, oh man, father time is really something else. And so you won't believe what happened to me this morning. So I was setting up the workouts for this week because you know we're doing the cleanse and win challenge and i put 10 minute workouts for people who are you know just don't only have a lot a little bit of time and they're kind of getting into the workout i make sure everybody has a 10 minute workout so i was going back and i was looking at some of my old 10 minute workouts and i saw the wow workouts i used to do wow workouts for 10 minutes and you know one of the raw stars uh robin had come down to visit me in mexico and she we did some wow workouts and i looked at those workouts and i was like Wow, <laughs> like I couldn't even believe, like I was like, if I did that today, man, I don't even know if I'd be able to do it. We started off with a hundred rocket squats with touching the ground and touching the ceiling and it didn't stop for 10 minutes. It was absolute fire. I just looked at myself, it was more than 10 years ago. I think it was like 12 or 13 years ago. And I just felt like, oh my God, she was so powerful. And then it asked the question like, what happened? What happened? Well, life does happen to us, you guys. As we get older, so many things happen. You know, our responsibilities change. Um, the time that we can put towards fitness changes. But then as I was doing the workout, I thought to myself, you know what? I'm still here. And guess what? Tyson was still in the ring, you guys. No matter what, 29 months, were, he was in the ring. He prepared himself, he was fit. So we are still here, you guys, in life, no matter what stage you are. If you are not at the level you were 10 years ago, if you are not at the level you want to be, let me tell you something, you are still here. And the beauty of life is that there's always two sides to everything in life. There's a top to the bottom, a front to the back, a side to the side. There is nothing in nature that's just one-sided. So if you're looking back on some version of yourself going, oh man, I used to be, could be, one be, should be. I want you to say, I'm still here and there is still life ahead of you. So there is still an opportunity for you to shape your future with how you feel about yourself. And then now it is so important that you shape your future with a positive viewpoint of yourself in the now. So I was doing the workout today and I was like, you know what? I'm badass because guess what? 14 years later, I'm still here. I think it was like between 13 and 14 years ago. So listen, you guys, if you're watching this video, I want you to say to yourself, I'm still here. I'm still in this game called life. You are still in it and you have so much available to you, so much that you can grow and strengthen the human body is just amazing. You can shape it and mold it and do all kinds of things with it once you set your intention to believe in yourself, your belief in yourself. When you do that, everything is possible 100% of the time. It may not look like it did in the past because guess what? That's the past. You can't get it back. But what you can do is shape your future right now. You can start to shape your future right now. So how you show up today is a good reflection of how you're going to show up yesterday. So I can look back at that video and go, hey, I'm still doing videos today. I'm still here. Because guess what? Being here is a gift. Being here is a gift. This, gift, this thing called life is a gift. And you get to shape how you want to appreciate and take care of your gifts, you guys. So our gifts are we have health and wellness. We have possibility to constantly, our human body is so amazing, get better and move ahead. So that's why I do these challenges, you guys. Not only to challenge you, but to challenge me. And I'm so grateful. I'm so grateful for understanding exercise science. I want to just break down exercise science to you. As we get older, you can see, even in the Tyson fight with Jake Paul, like the, the mobility is not the same, but guess what? Tyson still had a lot of muscle and that's what keeps you strong. And that's what we get to focus on as we're getting older because of the, the 
the cartilage in the knees over time does decrease. The muscle tissue does decrease every single year. So when you're doing the same thing and expecting to get the same result, you're not gonna get the same result. You have to sort of adjust yourself to the changes in your body. This is why you guys, I'm always talking to you guys about how do you combat the loss of muscle tone and still advancing in your fitness level and taking care of your joints, right? So I am doing more muscle tone workouts and heavier weights, and that means that my muscles need more energy. So I give myself a pea protein shake, which I have, I do with you every day on um, Instagram, the breakfast at Tiffany's, well not every day, most days. It's a pea protein shake mixed with collagen for the joints. So how do we stay here and shine? Then you gotta take care of yourself in different ways than you do when you're younger. I'm sure that Jay Paul's regimen was different from Tyson's regimen with a 30 year age gap or more, about 30 years, right? Because Jay Paul has more muscle tissue naturally, more collagen naturally, and then Mike Tyson would have to supplement. And when they're in the ring, whether you believe it was fixed or not fixed, guess what? They were both in the ring. And that's what I want to say. Are you in the ring of your life or are you a spectator of your life? Are you looking back and watching others and seeing what they do? Are you actually stepping forward and seeing what you can do, right? So what you can do is you can continually shape your life, your health and your fitness from this day forward. And you get to recognize where you are and where you can make adjustments in your nutritional science to move forward. So I said, Number one, you gotta lift more muscles. Feed your muscles protein. It's a body melt pea protein shake that I take every day. Feed your joints collagen. You gotta have the collagen every day. That's for your joints. Next thing, clean your gut regularly because as the years go by, so listen, Jake Paul only had like about 27 years of waste in his body that is not. Uh, Mike Tyson has 56 out of 58 years, right? So as we get older, our organs are actually getting older too. So how do you keep them young? You do a deep clean of your organs. You do a deep clean of your intestines. So it's like, if you wanna keep your kitchen in good shape, right? You, if you, sometimes if you open the microwave, you gotta scrub it out. If you open the stove, you gotta scrub it out. Your refrigerator, you gotta scrub it out. You gotta clean the things that you use every day. And you use your body every day. You eat every single day. So you wanna clean those intestines. That's why I'm doing the cleanse to win uh, challenge because with these products, this tea, it's a gentle tea, and it's amazing, let me tell you, it's amazing. Um, and gently, you drink the tea, that's all you gotta do, and it cleans out your intestines. Well, what does that do? When it cleans out your intestines, it takes out all that inflammation. So a lot of times when you're older, you have a lot of inflammation in your body. Inflammation is where um, uh, viruses live, where bacteria lives, where illness lives. So you definitely want to eliminate the inflammation from your body and you do that with the cleanse. So if there were three things that were actually, there's another thing, your vitamins, your supplements. So before, you know, I think our food quality was a lot better in the past because we didn't have things like Monsanto and the GMO, but I don't want to say it because like they've, they've been flagging my page, right? But I do want to say that our food quality is not the same as it was. So you must supplement your vitamins. You have to because most people are eating the same 10 to 15 things all the time. That is not giving you a full spectrum of nutrition. So you have to make sure that you supplement that. I'm doing a Nutriverse vitamin that helps me to supplement my nutrition and actually keeps me from getting hungry throughout the day because my body is satisfied. A lot of times when you're hungry, it's because your body is not getting the nutrients that it needs. When it doesn't get the nutrients that it needs, it's not functioning at its best. Your metabolism is not functioning as well. Your energy level is down. You're feeling sluggish because you're malnourished. So you definitely want to get that vitamin intake up. I like the liquid vitamin because it's super fun. If you guys want to hear about any of these things, just let me know. There's a protein powder, there's a collagen, there is the um, cleanse, and there is the vitamin. Those are the things that I recommend so that we can be our best 
and create our future moving forward. We get to use who we are. We get to get in that game of life and play to win and stop making life a spectator sport. If you're on your couch and you're watching me and you're watching others do something but you're not doing anything, I encourage you to get up and step up and start being a participant in this thing called life. It's only a game and you always win at the game you're playing. I say play to win, baby, play to win. So it starts within. you got to get up and get going and begin your life today. Whoever you are today is the best indication of who you're going to be tomorrow. So get up and make it happen this morning. This is my motivation for you. Monday morning motivation. Get in the game and play to win. Set your intention to move your body today. Set your intention to move your muscles today. Set your intention to feed and nourish yourself today. Set your intention to know that you are still here and you matter. You matter. You matter. I love you. Have a beautiful day. Bye.